This afternoon we're introducing you to our 2020 Canada Trailers 14 foot, 14,000 pound extreme duty dump trailer. In the video we show the trailer going up with our remote control. So we're power up and we want to talk about this a little bit on our hydraulic options. We're power up. You can see our big heavy duty 5 inch hydraulic cylinder and we're gravity down. When guys are buying trailers, they ask myself, Keith, and they ask my brother Greg, why power up, gravity down versus power up, power down? Why versus the, the heavy duty scissor lift hoist versus uh, two hydraulic cylinders with one hydraulic cylinder? Everything on the dump box is powered by, in this particular case, an extreme duty interstate battery. The whole system is based on the electric power that is in that battery. When you're powering up and gravity down, the electric uh, current is only being asked for and demanded for in one direction. So that means you're going to get twice as many dumps out of one charge. Now, in the trailer, we have a built-in 110 battery charger. You do, if you've been using like, contractors, our contractors that buy them from us, for an example, uh, they're using them day in and day out, going to the dump and dumping off their job sites. They'll plug that in at night, just like plugging your vehicle in in the winter time. That keeps it's a five amp charger, and it keeps that battery completely charged. A lot of nice features on our Canada trailer dump box. You'll notice right up front we've got a 12,000 pound drop drop leg spring loaded jack. Most of our competitors are using either a five or a 7,000 pound drop leg jack. We have spray-on box liner material, scorpion spray-on box liner material, not just powder coated paint. Much, much tougher, uh, virtually indestructible for stones and rocks and that sort of thing. It is on the front of the trailer as well. On the side of, or on the front of the dump here, we have a total, totally uh, pre-manufactured heavy-duty steel tarp shroud. It protects against ice, snow, debris. It also it has a steel plate on the top that keeps the sun off of your tarp so your tarp doesn't rot. On the side, we've got on the box, we're 83 inches wide, we're 14 feet long, and we've got 30 inches of depth, 30 inches deep. Now with your treated board here on the side, if you're loading with a front end loader, a bobcat, any of those types of things, if you slip on the joystick, you hit the board, you're not damaging the side of the trailer. The rest of the trailer's uh, powder coated paint, we have two 7,000 pound uh, grease axles, uh, Dexter components on the axles, radial tires all the way around. You can see the body stiffeners in the side of the boxes, just like a grain truck, gravel truck box for guys that are on the construction site or on the farm. LED lights all the way around. We have a two-way gate at the back. This is your spreader handle. You trip it on either side to spread if you're spreading rocks or dirt. And we have the barn door gate at the back. We have the galvanized six foot ramps, pull out ramps. Most of our competitors are using either a four or five foot ramp, which is fine, other than your load angle if you're putting a compact diesel tractor or skid steer or anything like that into the trailer, much steeper load angle. Right away, we have the 5,000 pound D-rings uh, welded right into the trailer. You can see the tarp has got, instead of a bungee cord or anything like that, it has its own slot that securely holds that tarp in place when you're going to the dump. That's about it. Uh, we have them in 12 foot lengths, 14 foot lengths, um, any other sizes up to 20 feet long, starting at 10 feet long. Uh, 